This is a millennial, and this is a millennial at work. What do we really know about this generation outside of their Facebook page? We know they love technology, clearly. But what about their work ethic, career goals, workplace culture, or even just what they want from life? Millennials are a complicated generation, and it's time for others to take note. Born between 1982 and 95, there are over 2.5 billion millennials. By the year 2020, millennials are expected to form 50% of the global workforce. They are now the largest generation working. We've experienced a time before the internet, embraced the technology boom, survived student loans, financial meltdowns, unpaid internships, minimum wage, underemployment, and temporary contracts. Millennials are expected to have the same impact on the world as the baby boom generation. So, how are they perceived? We're very entitled. They are very entitled. I think that we come in thinking we're entitled. It's like we don't really just want to stay in one place. Everybody thinks we're lazy. People think we're spoiled and lazy. We don't establish a career. We just like get in, work two years, get out. They're also not really interested in working past five. Okay, 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 so there's clearly some opinions about millennials. But these generalizations are often formed because of misunderstandings. Not all millennials are lazy, self-entitled, or narcissistic. It boils down to understanding the ways that we approach our work, careers, and our goals. And believe me, there are differences. You know, there are much more efficient ways that we want to do about things. I, I want to know that every day I'm walking in and I can make a difference in the workplace. Personally, I want a really healthy, collaborative workplace where I can learn from others and they can learn from me. They can tell when a young person comes in and actually wants to work hard and wants to, you know, wants to move up and wants to do things. They don't want to peter out when they're 25. It's a proven challenge to attract millennials and keep them at an organization. In fact, 91% of millennials expect to stay at a job for less than three years. This means they're expecting to have 15 to 20 jobs over the course of their working lives. It's simple. Working a job just doesn't suffice. We want more. In a recent study, 4,000 millennials across the globe were asked which benefits they most valued from an employer. Their top answer? training and development. Well, I wish I knew more, but there's not much I can do about that. That all comes with experience. I feel like it's coming. I think I need to focus. So sometimes when you're doing something and there's a lot of information that you need to get, sort of like narrowing it down, piecing it together piece by piece. It's more about getting and gaining that experience and making it transferable. Just don't know things until you don't know them. I think they need support, and I think it needs to be probably from the top down, as opposed to them reaching out. Teach me so I can like be better, and then in turn I can teach you. So if you're wondering what a millennial wants from the workplace, it's simple. They want to boost their resumes, achieve short-term goals, win awards, gain accreditation, get work experience, and never stop learning. So embrace the millennial boom, because we're not going anywhere.